Hi guys, this is Mariella with Concentris, and I'm going to walk you guys through how to mass delete customer item pricing via CSV imports. Uh, this is when multiple currencies uh, feature is enabled. So as you'll see, we have our customer above the cloud here and under the financial section, we have specific item pricing set up for this customer for these items. And in the instance that we wanted to completely remove and start from scratch or just completely remove this customer's pricing, we could do that via CSV. And what you would need to do is go to setup, import export, and then import CSV records. And then we have a template here um, where you're only going to need to map internal ID of the customer and then your other four columns, you'll leave blank. So item, unit price, we're working in multi-currency um, setup here. So currency and price level, you'll keep these all blank and just save the CSV file like this. Uh, once you're in the import assistant, you'll go ahead and select uh, relationships. Record type is customer only, and then you'll add in your file. Go ahead and click next. And here we're gonna select update. Like I said, we're removing the item pricing altogether. So what we're gonna do is select advanced options here, drop that down and tick this box, overwrite sublist. So this is going to completely overwrite any sublist data that we have. Um, replace, remove um, existing data. So go ahead and click that and click next. And you'll see NetSuite maps or tries to map our data. We're going to correct that, leave internal ID. Scroll down to the bottom on the NetSuite mapping field and go to item pricing. And let's bring all four of these fields over and map them to the columns that we had in our template. Go ahead and click next. And we're gonna name this import uh, removing item pricing. And go ahead and click save and run. You can click import job status here and see the progress of your import or go back to the customer record. Click refresh here. And again, you'll go back to the financial tab and go back to item pricing and you'll see all of those individual items that were listed that had um, absolute pricing for the customer are now removed. And if you wanted to start from scratch or just remove them all together, then this uh, upload is complete. Thanks guys.